All right, here we go, gang. This here is cowboy teaching on numbers. One through ten. I'm dialing in seven minutes here on the timer. It'll beep at us. And away we go. Yod. Yod hey. Y-H. Y-A-8. This is my scepter of righteousness. <laughs> Actually, I deserve this end. <laughs> I have no righteousness. My righteousness is in the right righteousness of the Lord Jesus Christ. This is the short form name of God on my cowboy hat. I've had people come up to us when I would play bass in the believers and ask me about my cowboy hat. This teaching is on counting to 10. And I ask many people to count to 10 and they always start with one. But if you're a mathematical genius, you would start with zero because zero, one half to one positive, but there's zero, one half to one negative in algebra. Okay, so you should start counting. And they found the oldest zero, I believe, in a flower garden in India. Uh, otherwise, uh, counting always started with one for many generations. Zero, one half, one. Life, God, one, God. L, first. L means first. The spirit, all right, spiritual, L. These are misspelled according to English, but not according to the spirit. Eternal, spelt spiritually, E-T-E-R-N, not A-L, but capital E, capital L with a singular dash, uh, spiritual. L means first strong and almighty. First title of God, L. God is a title. Lord is a title. El Yan, highest, is a title, all right? Two. T.W., true witness, all right? Truth, one plus two equals three. Glory, ascended three times in Ephesians, the fourth chapter. Two, resurrection on the third day. Not at the end of the third day, in the third day, halfway through the third day, he came out of the grave before dawn. Okay, major doctrine three, that's the most important for the number three major doctrine. Glory, El Yan, highest, four, Yah, which was written on my hat in Hebrew. Here it's written in English, Y-H, Y-A-H, hallelujah. This arrow coming back in this direction in Hebrew, 10, 5, 6, 5, the 10th letter, the 5th letter, the 6th letter, and the 5th letter. For a total, what is 10, 5, 5, 6 add up to? If you can do math in your head without a calculator or the digital cash register doing the math for you, it adds up to 26, all right? The 10th letter, the 5th letter, the 6th letter, and the 5th letter. Always in Hebrew, the 6th letter of the Hebrew alphabet is V, 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 not W. Wa is a lower man-centered understanding of the sacred sacred name, okay? Yahweh, it's Yava, V, Vi, Vav, Vervet, the sixth letter of the Hebrew alphabet looks like this. And it doesn't come out of the middle, it comes out of the right corner end. If it comes out of the middle, it's a different letter. Four. Four sacred letters in the sacred name in the short form. Two letters, which is my cowboy hat right there, going in the opposite direction of English. The smallest figure in Hebrew with a value of 10. 10 is completion, fulfillment, finished, fill, completion. 10-5 is what you're looking at there numerically. All right, we move on from four over here to five, mercy, H added to Abram's name because he had 
the grace, the favor, and the mercy of God. Sarai got Sarah got an H added. That's why I had a alias for many of my teachings for over a year. Arrow Anderson, A R R O H E Anderson, S O N. Five, six. The male Adam was created on the sixth day. Also the female. Why? So he wouldn't be lonesome and she would be a helpmate in this circle with the little waves right there is womb water, the natural birth. Nicodemus, you must have the natural birth and then the second spiritual birth. Okay, that's what this is. Blue, water, humanity. Okay, four, down to nine. Nine is judgment. Humanity will be judged. Seven. Rest in peace. He rested on the seventh day. It's about entering his rest, entering his peace. The peace is in Christ. It's all out from the one. The one is the dot. The long one is God in the center. The one Holy Spirit. And then the seven spirits of God in Revelation. So there's seven dashes here before the throne. Seven. Rest in peace. Eight. New beginnings. A door. If you turn this eight on its side, you've got infinity and an intersection and a door. The first turn to the left is in this world. And the second turn to the right is in the right righteousness and holiness of God in the next life. Saint, son, servants. That's the highest title you can see. I don't know if you can see it in the very bottom. We've got percent here with two circle of lives connected. Nine is judgment. Ten, Elikai. Okay, that's my spiritual soldier warrior name in the Old Testament. One, 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 four times. Four letters in the sacred name. That's why four is so special. There's seven minutes. Ten, one and zero. This is the authority sword. Let me shut my beeper off. It's it's competing with me. Lord God, the name is not always a reference. These are two titles to the name Jesus. Sometimes, half the time, when you see name, it's in reference to his authority, power, might, and glory. Name authority. All right? And here's the game of tic-tac-toe. And I put the alpha arrow with the little teeny leg in the bottom for the Greek A. That's an alpha arrow, always points above. Colossians, the third chapter. Above, above, life, life, appearing, appearing. And there's the teaching from the cowboy in his brown vest and his cowboy hat on with his jewelry. And this one shines and points above at a 45 where the Lord Jesus Christ is seated. Love you. Bye.